those two cobras all over again right here. Look at this, we got some, I think they're Takin, Takins here. I can't pronounce the names, Takin or Takin, it's one of the two. Kind of look like Banthas, if you think about it, from Star Wars. Got a wrinkled hornbill over here. It's actually saying something over here. Whoa! 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 Someone's got anger management problems. There it goes. Neighbors make quite a racket, don't they? Yeah. Goodness. African crowned eagle. Look at you. All right, so at this moment, we are now all the way at the other side of the zoo, literally. So there's the entrance. We're <laughs> all the way on the other side, literally. So we're doing pretty good so far, I'd say. The ostriches. Yep, there's one. Probably one of my favorite animals right there. The ostrich. All right, so I see the kudu to my right. Over here, there's another one over there. Those antlers, wow.
So in here we have the Madagascar radiated tortoise, like the one we saw in the lair. But right now it is underneath the heat, the heated lamp right over here on the rock, under the rock, right in there. And here we have the ring-tailed lemurs. Coming, they're coming out. <laughs> Whoa, wait a minute. Holy smokes, look at the tails of those guys. It's not my foes. At least his relatives. And there's one right there. Look at that face. Oh, there's another one at the top, I think. Right up there. There's one more, right up there. In the heat. They all got their own little spots. Yeah, these guys were just added to the zoo very recently, like within the last year. And you got this guy over here, the blue-eyed lemur, who I think is taking a nap right up there. I think all the, most of the animals are going to be taking naps now because it's getting close to when they close the park. Park. <laughs> I'm at the zoo. All right, we basically have seen all of this now. We were over here. We saw finally this guy. Oh, yeah. We need to see Troublemaker over here. Because last time I was over here, he was banging against the, the boards and all. But now we're heading this direction, downwards, towards Australia. Ow, back should hurt. <laughs> Sounds like the lion is roaring. I guess the chimpanzees went backstage, but uh, they were making a racket just a few seconds ago. <laughs> These are old Paki. I just remember what they were called. Very interesting creatures. So we got in here, Bonder Deacon's hornbills. There's one, two, three, four of them in here. We also have a black duker in here as well. Whoa. It seems like they're sharpening their beaks. Oh, there's five of them in here. Oh my goodness. There's another black duker in here as well. They're literally sharpening their beaks. Look at that.
they're using the the branches to to sharpen their beaks. That is crazy. And then here we also have a Ross Turicos. Terrico, sorry. Right there. I think that's the bird I saw in the other uh, aviary, which I didn't see a picture of, but now I know what it is. Well guys, that's going to do it for part four of my special January 2020 series from right here at the Los Angeles Zoo. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up button. It is greatly appreciated. Be sure to check out my other vlogs as well as my other channels, the educational series, the design video series, and the travel town series. I'm also on Instagram. Thank you so much for watching and seeing, as I say in Hollywood, I'm actually leaving the Los Angeles Zoo. That, my friends, is a wrap.